Hi, my name is Dan. I'm the owner and skipper of Gossamer Penguin, a 1977 O'Day 22. She's short, she's underpowered, and she was never meant for racing. We race her anyway. Join me and K-Pop and C-Bomb and Timo and special guest star Mike from Banshee and uh, we're gonna go racing tonight. It's a long one tonight. We're going to 18, then 14, then 18, then 11, and then back to the club. Uh, it's probably a six and a half, seven mile race. And uh, we've got some new competition tonight. Geezer's back after losing her mast, hooray. Uh, and we've got, uh, Sophia is back after a year long hiatus. So we've got actual competition tonight. Um, it's coming right down the river. We're gonna fly the chute, try and do a set like we did last week. And yeah, anything else? No? All right, here we go, let's go racing. Put in the electric outboard! <laughs> Your halyard hung up? Yeah. Bugger! Oh, yeah. See how it's hooked around the, whatever that the top shiny thing is there? It looks like they're, yeah. Yeah, that is right. Nope. Now, how come you decided to pack so quickly? Um, so, you don't, you the, don't uh, want to get in the channel? Yeah. Because that'll be slow you down? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, so you got to decide what side of the channel you prefer to be on. And yeah, and it's deeper over here, so the water's moving faster, but it's coming from the Jersey side. Um, and I don't want to get shattered by those trees, so I'm just going to keep on sneaking up the seawall. We're going to make a whole lot of little tacks. Well, you just try to stay like in line, or like when you tack again, it'll be like right on the line, where that buoy is, or a little bit of a green marker. Um, I'm mostly just looking at like, 
I kind of draw myself a line that way. I'm like, I'm going to point at that when I'm done. And I bring it around like 90 degrees. And then we just sail the boat. Uh, last time it was but just... they went down in the boat. And if I went sorry. down, we motored the whole way. Yeah. yeah. Well, they threw. They <laughs> you, you tried to fly a sail a little, little more trip. Well, I was just going to talk about that because you motored down until you saw us, and then you threw up the sail, and we were tacking, 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 tacking. And we saw you throw up the sail, and we're having trouble, and we're like, should we go back for them? And we turned around and came back for you, and then you <laughs> put it in the motor again. <laughs> like, we just gave up so much ground. Well, see, guys, I was. Hours worth of progress. Because I was so, uh, I was, I was excited to go on the trip. So I'm like, oh, cool, we're gonna sail the boat. I'm gonna learn about sailing. Yeah, now you learned about like, outboards. No, all I learned about was how to motor a sailboat and eat lots of snacks. <laughs> how many cans of chili did you eat? Cans of chili. Dan says it was good. Yeah. <laughs> Put the rig up, like sail it hard the first time. Everything that breaks is gonna break anyway. So just fix it. <laughs> it's real easy to say it was on my boat. Where they are. Yeah, no, we're not going over there. Although we draw a lot less than them. We could probably go right up next to them and still be floating. Look, sup. <laughs> they all they all made fun of the penguin until they didn't stuff it in the mud. Here we go, coming around. I I mean, there there are two kinds of sailors: those who have run aground and liars. <laughs> I love having new people on the boat because I get to deliver all these like boaty witticisms like they're mine. <laughs> like I didn't read them on like sailing Facebook. <laughs> what am I gonna do without a hand? Pull. No, my my wind. You got a starboard boat. The ability to have a hand. Oh, it's Better a, duck. You can only pull. No hand. Can you install? <laughs> Yeah, man. <laughs> then you get on the board, you turn into an asshole. <laughs> every inch, every inch I can get. <laughs> Dan, how are you? Deciding how much to trim the main there. Um, watching it. Uh, oh, just try to get a certain shape. Or? Yeah. So uh, if you look at the the forward edge, see how it's like a little bit. It's coming in toward me. That forward edge by the mast. All right. So like if I do this, see how that like just popped uh, it's in. It's a little loose. There right. Now. So I bring it in, but I'm also watching my telltales in the back and see how they're wrapping around. Back here, this back edge. Turn around. Okay. This back edge. Oh, See, yeah. like that bottom one's streaming back, but the top one's kind of like, well, it's just being dodgy. But uh, I watch those. If they start like curling around the back of the sail, that means I'm over trimmed. I need to let it out a little bit. Uh, so I'm just kind of co constantly playing between those back telltales and the uh, the shape of the luff there. Okay. And then the camera died. Um, we put up the red sail and uh, it was pretty okay. A lot of square footage. I dug that. Um, we have uh, uh, re-rigged it since then. And um, yeah. Tom, what'd you think about uh, last week? Oh, it was, it was a great time. I, I had a lot of fun. It was cold but... and wet and miserable. It yeah. was not a great time. Tim. I wasn't there. It's all right. The base is too long, so we didn't finish the bed. <laughs> See you, Bob. Uh, it was kind of a crummy night for a lot of people. Um, poor Lena Rasa got grounded. Lena Rasa got grounded, like real hard grounded. Ooh, yeah. yeah. Uh, no, he, uh, 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 Lena Rasa's skipper went back to the boat at 10.30 after the tide came back up and, uh, and sailed it off the, uh, sailed it off. Of all of, all of B fleets, only two boats made it over? Yeah. Right? That's correct. It was Dr. Pepper and uh, Geezer. Geezer were yeah. the only two in our entire fleet who managed to get over the line. Like, right at the cutoff point, too. Yeah, yeah Song, Songbird that. and Shadowfax made it across. 
because I was there last week. Yeah, no, it was a it was a slow night. There was no wind. Uh, what you saw was was it. It was just cold and wet and no wind and slow and blah. We're hoping. Uh, well, um, th this this is last week. I'm I'm, very, I'm I'm not. But it's less rain and more pleasant yes. temperatures. Yeah, but like this is going at the it's end of the bad. video for last week. Right. So. Oh, that's right. Wait, are you pregnant? <laughs> well, that's going in. <laughs> <laughs> we are here on YouTube at SV Gossamer Penguin. We are on Facebook at SV Gossamer Penguin. We are on Twitter at Gossamer Penguin. We are on uh, uh, Patreon. We're not on Instagram. Again, we're not on Insta. Actually, we might be. Yeah, we Actually, we are. Instagram. Oh shoot, we are on Instagram. Okay. SV Gossamer we also Penguin. Are on on Reddit. Well, uh, no. <laughs> I, I, mean, I am on Reddit. The boat is not. The boat should be. I guess. I guess. Um, oh, and we are also on Patreon uh, at SV Gossamer Penguin. Every dollar that uh, comes in from Patreon goes back into parts for the boat to to make us go faster. And um, if it doesn't go into parts for making us go faster, it'll go into the bucket for the uh, the faster penguin boat uh, fund. And we're hoping that uh, someday we'll be on something that's a little bit more racy. We'll see. A puffin. A puffin. I've got ideas. All right. Uh, we will see you next time. I'm not even going to say next week because I have no idea what my schedule is like. Uh, next time. Next video. We'll see you. Bye.